Hi everyone. Good evening to all of you and uh, welcome to your new family called All Diety. My name is Shatakshi. I am going to be your host for today along with Naman Shivasta and as few of you might already know I am also the co-founder and co-CEO of All Diety, a beautiful community that you all have signed up to join. Naman, if you quickly want to say hi to the community and then of course more than happy to introduce you to the community as well for those of you of course who don't know who Naman is. Absolutely. Congratulations everyone. We are absolutely delighted to meet you and I'm fairly certain we will be meeting each other very often going forward. So look forward to being a part of your journey. Thank you so much for trusting us and we will do our best to ensure that the trust is respected. Okay, Takshi, and look forward to again connecting. Perfect. Thanks, Naman, for those enthusiastic words. For those of you who don't know, Naman and I co-lead Global Governance Initiative. Uh, of course, we have uh, known each other for more than eight years now. Now we do a lot of interesting education ventures and create a lot of meaningful impact in the lives of others. I have a quick question from any one of you. Why do you think we are here today? Anyone? Arvind, why do you think we are here? Yeah, hi, good evening all of you. Uh, oops, uh, so I think we are here to upgrade ourselves. That is what I think. Uh, that's the most uh, important basically in the technology aspect of things which is like rapidly taking over everything every aspect of our life that is the reason, most important reason i can think of sure that's true my question was slightly different why are we all here today we are not going to be upgrading ourselves in just one hour so chanmaya uh, chinmaya i really hope i'm pronouncing your name right why do you think we are here today Hi, Sataksi and Naman. Thank you for giving me this opportunity, first of all. Uh, I hope this will be going to be a great session with you all. And I believe, uh, as far as your question is concerned, I think, uh, as far as today's class is concerned, basically, we will be knowing each other, uh, why we, have, we are here and on what common terms we can uh, basically improve our communication skills apart from uh, learning technology in all six months we are going to be here. And, uh, and at last we will be able to connect with a lot of great amount of people uh, which will help us earn or uh, let's say bring up uh, basically a great lot of networking opportunities for us. In consulting there is a saying, we have messy answers, mutually exclusive, collectively exhaustive. Chinmaya said everything, one of them has to be right, right? So Chinmaya, good attempt, uh, one of the answers was right. <laughs> Uh, but of course, look forward to having you in the next six months and of course for a lifelong journey with us. I'll have one more person who can take a shot at why are we really here today? Poonama, go on. I see this as a meet and a greet kind of a session, like just to sort of have a glimpse of what the session would look like going further, try to see some, put some faces to the names and uh, introduce ourselves to the team, get to know the team more, that's what it is. Sure, almost right answer. So, Poonima is right. Now, let's move towards the main agenda. I know all of you put in a lot of trust, put in a lot of effort to come here and join Alt IIT. I also know that a lot of you have gazillion questions about what the curriculum would be, about what the diversity of the cohort will be, about how I'm going to be managing my time, about how my next six months and the most transformative journey of all IIT is going to be. So the next one hour that we are going to be spending with you is understanding that you have questions and help you settle in. All right. So we have lined up an agenda for all of you. It is approximately nine point slides. I know as a consultant, I still hate slides, but they still come in handy many a times when you have a long agenda. And towards the end, we will also be taking each and every individual question. 
it's an extraordinary opportunity for you because typically just the first cohort gets this opportunity i mean this when i say this you guys are lucky and so am i because you are joining a very interesting ship for life naman and i till date remember each and every person who joined january 2019 global governance initiative cohort i know each and every person by name by their face and what they are doing in life i really hope that that's what is going to happen with all 50 of us together as we hop on to a new ship called alt iit and we all sail together with that i am going to be sharing my screen i am going to be helping you understand the why the what and the how of alt iit end to end and if there will still be questions left we will be here naman is here i am here we will take each and every question to help you smoothly settle in if after that also you will have questions then my admissions team will be here we will be meeting first and third weekend of every month for your master classes then we will be there to answer each and every question as well your success is our success i repeat your success is our success if you do not succeed then we fail that's the simple rule of thumb in education if you don't succeed we fail that's the simple rule in education sector and naman and i got it extremely right in our initial years of gji for those of you who don't know gji that was our first education startup in the mbn mpp space first and foremost what is alt iit for most of you if you are sitting in this room i assume that you know what is alt iit but from our side i am someone who bravely calls myself the first alt iitian of the alt iit community i am going to be proudly wearing that on my sleeve that i am an alt iit life i didn't crack iit while iit at an outcome level could produce gazillions of jobs in 21st century we wanted to impact not technology but future of technology and hence it took us a massive level of research to figure out that we just want to do an impact three sectors system designing artificial intelligence and tech product management to build a more inclusive society in both businesses and in public policy domains you could by the way do an ai role with governments also with think tanks also similarly you can do a tech pm role in governments and businesses and multilateral organization our mission at all iit is to build more inclusive system so that anyone who was left behind early in their life do not get disadvantaged throughout their life few of you are iitians i know that and i think it just furthers our point that we are building an inclusive system and community at all iit very briefly this is my journey so far most of you once again might know this in terms of what i have done and how i have done that a graduate from st stephen's college for the initial 5 years work in strategy in both public policy and strategy as well was extremely blessed to work directly with the chairman of mckinsey and company then of course went for my formal mba that is when on the mba campus naman and i co-founded global governance initiative after that of course went to hps fletcher school of law and diplomacy spent two years at bcg uh, today i give a great deal of uh, my gratitude for being part of that alumni network because they gave back uh, today a lot of leadership of bcg india and globally support gj and now all iit uh, then of course i did international affairs role in tony blair institute and now of course i'm full time running uh, all iit along with global governance initiative in terms of my exposure to technology i would say throughout my last 10 years i have been massively exposed to technology i've seen peers and friends being politely asked to leave because they couldn't manage future of technology that typically means that many a times upskilling most importantly in technology is a mindset game i repeat it's a mindset game then a hard skill the moment you sign up that yes i have to sign up for this upskilling the closer you are to that answer and the fact that you have already signed up for this community is a step one towards that moment but mind you it's not final step it's just the first step and i will also give you examples why do i say whatever i say let me actually give you an anecdote 
There are 900 people on ISB campus, 600 in Hyderabad, 300 in uh, largely your Mohali campus. Can anyone take a guess how many people out of these 900 people want to work in McKinsey BCG Bain in terms of their learning outcomes? How many people want to work in consulting? Wild guess, raise your zoom hand. Shubham Vashisht. All, almost all of them. Maybe. 700, 780. There are almost 100, 150 who are very clear they want to work in product management, ISB being a consulting in PM school. Another question, how many do you think actually McKinsey BCG Bain take from ISB? Ankita? I think it's around only 70 to 80. That's almost the right answer. Why did I say that you are taking your step one towards your learning? Because you have done just the same thing that a lot of people do when they sign up for their formal MBA program or formal degrees. It's the journey after that matters. It is the rigor after that matters. And this rigor mostly is going to be extremely important for you. We are going to be there to help you. We are going to help you succeed. But if you are not going to do the homework for your own self, pretty hard for you to succeed. Just the plain reality of life. May sound harsh, but that's how life operates. As we move ahead and we talk about Alt IIT, I want to talk about bets in life, especially asymmetric bets in life. I'm someone who took an asymmetric bet in life. Is there anyone who understands what is an asymmetric bet? Raif, what is asymmetric bet? Also, I hope I'm pronouncing your name right. Yes, it is. Uh, yeah, so an asymmetric bet is like, you know, uh, like a do or die situation where you go all in on your uh, efforts, energy, resources, everything. The focus is on the term asymmetric. What are symmetric right. bets? Your reward so, proportionately, thanks Raif, your reward yeah, yeah. proportionately is proportionate to your effort. If you take 3x effort, you get 3x reward. Asymmetric bet is, if you take 3x effort, you if you lose, it's going to minus 10x loss and 110x may be reward. That's why it's asymmetric. It's not linear. It is exponential in terms of rewards and it is equally exponential in terms of penalty. Why am I talking about asymmetric bets? You all have taken an asymmetric bet by signing up for Alt IIT. I am not unaware of the fact this is the first cohort of Alt IIT. Yet 49 of you are sitting here and listening and are going to be signing up for your upskilling and hence give a pat on your back for signing up for this asymmetric bet in life. In all innovations, there are early movers and then there are adopters. You should be proud for being an early mover in life. That is what I was. Of course, I have lost many times. But whatever output I am today is also because of those asymmetric bets in life. Not many people have the courage to take asymmetric bet. We are sitting in 2023. What will happen to Alt IIT in 2025 and 2026 is going to be phenomenal. But you will get the most benefit out of it. Why? Because you signed up early. The reality is also signed up at a discounted price because you took a risk upon yourself. Right? So always be little grateful in life that I was not the ordinary one. Why? because I took a asymmetric bet in life. Now, the most important thing, the objective of all IIT is just and one only, which is that my objective and Naman's objective and our entire team's objective is to make sure that you succeed and thrive. Is to make sure that you succeed and thrive, nothing else. I really wish that you all make a lot of money at the same time with a lot of health and well-being as well. I really wish that from the bottom of my heart. But what are the components because of which you succeed? How do you succeed in life? Anyone? Kar? By the way, if you want to be called by me, have your camera on. Go on, Shikhar. Yeah, so I would say uh, constant learning mindset has 
helped me throughout my like uh, career so i think one of the answers would be a constant learning mindset with a constant rigor to of of curiosity to learn something new and progress in life that is one way of uh, you know progressing but the other way that i i nowadays I, i'm i'm learning myself through experience is networking so networking is one and yeah again hard work is the third thing so learning uh, networking and uh, you know uh, hard work spoken like a true consultant three points i agree to what shikhar has said learning but many a times you know things you can't communicate them many a times you have gazillion people that you know but not even one shows up to help you in your moment of truth what is moment of truth moment of truth is when you are almost at the cusp of failing and you just want one helping hand do you get that or not beyond your family of course family stands by you no matter what i have different rule of thumb then what shikhar said and i'm going to be taking a leaf from what shikhar said learning is there but so is communication i know of so many people who are extremely knowledgeable but when it comes to communication especially in certain sectors i'm not talking about scientists in most of the sectors if you can't communicate your thought well then it's not going to augur well for you and hence at all diet we are not just going to be teaching you the tech stuff your edge will come from the communication from the business behind the coding most of the coders code in silos they don't even know the why behind the coding or the business context behind the coding and rare case if they know the business context behind the coding they are not able to communicate it well that's point number 1 point number 2 i genuinely believe that network is a heavily exploited term used in a lot of circles so shikhar is right i am going to just use a better language for it community people who look out for each other people who are going to vouch for each other people are not in a toxic rat race or competitive towards each other and the last one is good mental well being if you are really nervous and anxious person but you get the skills right you get the community right on the d day when your moment of truth comes either in an interview or during your promotion cycle it's not going to augur well it's pretty rare if you're a person with poor mental well being that you are going to have a very good mental well being on the d day to my mind these are the fundamental pillars of having some bit of success and thriving and all iit is going to provide you all of that and that's why upskilling is just one let me be very candid in all iit there are going to be three pillars of your master classes number 1 your fundamental master classes and we are going to talk about that number 2 your application based master classes i am going to be working very closely with speakers to make sure that the right curriculum is delivered and this right curriculum is t- coming directly from stanford where we conducted exponential number of interviews for all of you but the reality is it's the community that is coming and helping me as an entrepreneur as an entrepreneur i can't succeed if i take the entire burden on my head and i say i'm going to deliver technology curriculum marketing everything but it's not the network it's the community all right as we move ahead and we have talked about very powerful diverse community i understand that few of you come from really different backgrounds few of you are extreme beginners you don't know anything about technology be it future technology few of you are already working in data science since n number of years few of you are complete undergrads some few of you are mothers and having kids of your own in fact i derive a lot of inspiration because at some point of time i will have to cover that journey for myself as well but why am i talking about diverse community you all are as good as the community the moment you get that right the closer you are to success if uddhav gets one job right for his dream and after 6 months into his job divya also wants that job and if uddhav helps her out 
then the next time Uddhav wants a job, maybe Divya may not be able to help, but someone else will help. The moment you understand, and that is what I think typically people from IIT, etc. get it right. They vouch for each other. They stand next for each other. They will give a referral for the job. They will help each other find co-founders and many other network opportunities. And unfortunately, most of us missed out on that opportunity and that community. All IIT is going to do that for you. So I'm aware that you all come from diverse backgrounds. You all will have something to offer to the community. Always, when it comes to community building and networking, think from the point of view: What can I give? In India, unfortunately, we have a little parasitic mindset. What can I get? Most of the best leaders that I have worked with, they are always working with the setting or mindset of what can I give. The moment you become a giver in life, perpetually, when your moment comes, you will get help. And that is the mindset shift that I am trying to create in all IIT. It's a slow process. but you all have to sign up for that process because frankly iits do not actually succeed because of their four year curriculum in fact let me be very transparent after talking to more than 30 iitians what i realized is they are not learning anything relevant in terms of future technology few of them might be but most of them are not then why are they succeeding perpetually is because of that community mindset All right. Of course, we'll do a fantastic job at upscaling you also, but I want to make sure that you get the other components right, because these are the components that most don't know about, don't care about, and don't get as well. As we finally talk about your alt IIT ecosystem, I know it's a dense looking slide, but bear with me. Your entire alt IIT ecosystem is divided into three components, like I said. On the left hand side will be your community building exercises. On the extreme right hand side there will be employment opportunities that will come your way. I will also talk about when will the employment opportunities come your way. In the center is where your learning is sitting. And you see a wheel which is going to be your central and the main wheel of master classes. What those nine master classes are going to be I will also help you understand in some time. right from coding for engineers to entrepreneurship and funding to data analytics to machine learning to system design we will cover them all trust me when i say this we have been talking to more than 35 industry practitioners not from india but from san francisco and bay area as well who are defining the curriculum what you are going to be learning at all iit within the learning component after you will complete level 1 you will also do a startup weekend we really want to generate future leaders and not just job takers at all iit and you will also go through a buddy program what is a buddy program you all once in every 3 weeks will be mapped to each other on a one on one basis to practice assignments to practice interview preparation example if shraddha and shubham are mapped to each other in next week it will not happen next week it will happen after your first master class only but imagine if they are mapped to each other for 3 weeks after that shubham will be mapped to let's say purnima and shraddha will be mapped to shivam we will keep on rotating this after every 3 weeks so that you all get to connect with each other on a one on one basis and get buddies every time to solve assignments but of course the solution of the assignment is sitting upon you it's your prerogative to solve for it in harvard stanford the reality is you don't get formed buddies you find buddies for yourself nobody hand holds you and finds a buddy for you yet at all tight in the first phase we have decided to map buddies to all of you all right so that's the bigger picture of all tight on left hand side there will be community building exercises when will that happen we will also let you know in later time on the right hand side are employment opportunities when will that happen we will also let you know and in the center is your learning setting as we move on i want to now talk about the fundamentals of all iit master classes do you see these master classes which are nine they have been divided into three components and the most important component the most important component is going to be the fundamental one why do i say whatever i say most of the artificial intelligence tech pm and system design interviews that you will take 
perhaps few of you are already working in that segment in fact if i'm not wrong there are few people who are already working in data science but the number one reason why people will fail interviews is not because of the application based learning but because they will not be able to get the fundamentals right so what is really important for you is irrespective of your pedigree irrespective of your current skill set irrespective of your experiences that you bring to alt iit make sure that you focus a lot on fundamentals in fact that's just not important for future tech roles that's important overall in interviews in life they will always be grilling you for fundamentals it's our job responsibility that we teach you our all we will make sure that right people come for each and every master class and teach you that but it's your responsibility to have laser sharp focus every time did i get the fundamentals right and as we talk of fundamentals like i said there will be three pillars of your weekend master classes fundamentals application based and soft skills based fundamentals application based and soft skills based what i am going to be doing is i am going to be sharing a glimpse of the tentative curriculum that we have designed for all of you don't worry this will come to you in the tomorrow's welcome email all right but i'm just giving you a glimpse of it on the left hand side you see fundamentals for the master class the first one is coding for ceos in fundamentals where you'll all learn python and most importantly in the world of chat gpt most of the real jobs you can have prompts as a developer you do need not write the code yourself and that is going to be the advanced thing that nobody is teaching in today's chat gpt world we want to make you smart developers and smart future tech leaders not just teach you that every tom dick and harry is teaching then we'll move to engineering arts and sciences which is my personal favorite that is when we'll rope in people like naman as well who is the co-founder who is going to be not just teaching you along with statistics but most importantly philosophy economics psychology many people miss out on the fact that most of the problems in life are not just tech based they are first and foremost psychology based think of what is happening with tiktok had they not covered the insight that human beings like to scroll up do you think developers would have been able to make tiktok so most of the interesting things happen at the intersection of course there is another ethical dilemma of building platforms like tiktok but coming back the best problems and their solutions are sitting at the intersection of arts and science and we are going to be covering them all and then of course we are going to be covering data structures and algorithms as well we'll move towards data analytics and machine learning with that we are moving towards your application based master class you'll first understand da and ml post that you'll talk about and you'll learn ethical artificial intelligence for impact and then of course we'll move towards product managers and platform for engineers we will not just be cracking product management case interview you'll also learn what is ab testing how do you convert product requirements to a technical requirement and last but not the least you'll go through system design that is your application based master class and my favorite this is where you get the edge at all iit these are things that are not taught outside and it's very consciously chosen There are hundred things we are not teaching you at all, Titi, and very consciously so. We have handpicked things that will help you in interview. We have handpicked things that will make you a future leader, and that's where you will learn management communication for future tech leader. In fact, that's going to be your first master class. And last but not the least, you'll go through entrepreneurship and funding as well. After this, after each and every master class, you'll be given detailed assignments. and most importantly the fundamental level you will be given very heavy assignments trust me when it comes to the world of technology and even for consulting after running gji for 5 years people who got into mckinsey bcg bain i realized were those who were self drivers they were extremely motivated people they were self driven folks they practiced 200 and 300 problems by themselves and they had a job pretty simple rule but what is the hard part in it that it is hard to do it takes motivation to do we are going to be curating the problems for you we'll do the all homework to design the problems for you but if you don't go back and do the homework and then complain that i didn't was not able to do magic then you always know what the reality is 
Like I said, step three is going to be your buddy system. Step four is going to be your networking nights. In networking nights, we will not talk about anything related to future tech or business or skills. We will just understand life as is, as raw as is. Step five will be your all IIT startup weekend, and the last step will be your employment opportunity. No need to take screenshots. Like I said, this is your document. This will come your way by tomorrow end of the day. as we are crafting a detailed welcome email for all of you with all the details that i'm sharing right now as i move back to your all iit journey there are going to be levels very important for you to note level 1 will give you a reward after you will finish five master classes at least and you will complete your worksheets post every day master class we will start opening employment opportunities to you all right but you have to attend each and every master class and complete their worksheet you can't expect an employment opportunity to come to you after first master class why because it's not in your interest and it's not my interest i'll tell you why we did this mistake by the way in gji and we realized people were not able to crack interviews what happens is i lost an employer because the employer will feel we didn't do a good job at training right and it was not that people just sat in very early for interviews right and now that we have cracked it beautifully at gj we realize that if well trained people are sitting for interviews it creates a win win employers love our people so much that they typically ask me and me what do you teach in the curriculum that people turn out to be better than i am bangalore folks and that's the objective i want to achieve here that you all turn out to be not equal but better not just an iit folks but stanford folks i know that our name says all iit but my bar will be always yay high for all of you and after you complete level 1 your level 2 will be your graduation status which will where your certificate will come if you complete n minus 1 master classes i'll fix this it will be 8 for all of you ignore the 5 and you finish your startup weekend that is when you will become eligible to get the graduation certificate from us don't run after the certificate run after the learning that's only for those who run after the certificate but that's okay i understand people need that all right but do remember these two levels are extremely important for you all right we have covered why are we all here we have also covered what your journey will look like from levels to the three types of master classes to your nine master classes coming from these three pillars of master classes and your entire all iit itinerary and ecosystem there is a detailed schedule that has been formed for all of you your master classes will take place first and third weekend of a month why am i sharing that because dates will come but most of the people forget dates so mindlessly know that as long as you are in the all iit ecosystem if it's first weekend of a month if it's third weekend of a month you will have a master class with us we consciously give breaks we consciously give breaks why because you have to do the homework I was talking to one of my BCG friends. He's a team leader, uh, and he asked me this very interesting question. He was able to get into IIT Delhi through a coaching class in Delhi, and he asked me, "Shatakshi, can you guess how many physics lectures do they teach? How many physics lectures do they teach? Take a wild guess. It's a very famous class, or how many do you think one should teach in terms of lectures of physics in two years?" It's a wild guess. I couldn't get it right. It's okay. Take a guess. Arvind? Maybe 20. 20 is the right answer, but typically coaching classes teach 200 classes of physics. There is a reason I'm sharing that example. This coaching class has the highest selection rate into IIT. They just teach 20 classes. There are gazillion coaching classes that are teaching 200 classes. they are not able to achieve the same selection rate which means that it's not the number of classes that matters what matters is what the student does after those classes so as we move ahead and we almost open up for any q and a these are the next steps after this session will get over first and foremost by end of the day tomorrow there is a detailed schedule that will come your way in the form of welcome email stay patient it will come to all of you we are on top of every detail i am personally overseeing this and i am going to oversee this for the next 2 years till the time system stabilizes 
and your first master class which is of management communication that Naman and I will personally take will come on the first weekend of June. That is when your officially program will start. It will become little ad hoc if we start it right now because throughout the year it's the first and the third weekend of a month when we are going to do things. All right. Now I am finally open for questions, if any. My understanding is that we would have covered most of the questions, but I understand life happens. You all are unique individuals. You all have unique aspirations. So Naman and I are here to take any questions. Shubham, you go first. Yes, Sitakshi, uh, am I audible? Yes, you are. Uh, so the thing is, I'm currently employed. I'm working, uh, and I have con- I have a small of an issue that my first and third Saturdays are working. So can you please just let me know what will be the timings because it will be difficult for me to attend those classes uh, on Saturdays. And preferably, if possible, can we have those on second and fourth because my second and fourth are off. So that is the situation. With me. Sure. Uh, uh, yeah. Shubham, at the outset. Welcome to the family. Second, yeah, thank, thank you, you so much. much for trusting us with your time, with your energy. Yeah. Two part answer. The first request is not possible of second and fourth. Why? Because we are building for the entire global community. Pretty hard for us to change the schedule. There is a very strong reason why we are doing whatever you are doing. Trust me on that. Second, I cannot give you the timings, and I'll also tell you why. industry practitioners across india and the world are going to come and take your master classes and you all will get details one week in advance we have been running chijes successfully since 5 years with that model hear me out we have been running chijes successfully since last 5 years with that model which is that on the sunday that the master class is going to come one weekend before that we are going to be sending a detailed curriculum and the detailed schedule of that master class that's the most i can do i suggest that you write an email to admissions because it's a very unique case all right let's connect later on but at this stage i i'm not sure if we will be uh, able to change naman okay, is unmuting uh, himself okay, okay. uh yeah shubham who do you work with uh i'm working with tata power actually why are they making you work on saturdays uh because the tata power has just taken over the state government uh, entities uh, recently 3 years back so there's a lot of work there are, i should say to do and the digitization process is a very the long process so it's that is why i've joined in also because i i my role is kind of a mixed bag of the product manager uh, thing so but i need to know the uh, code uh, code part also because uh, i have to connect with the it team on a lot of issues regarding the setting of the processes and getting the things done so see if you can do that efficiently monday to friday saturday to uh, but the, we have to go <laughs> the thing is that we have a punching system now you might be knowing that so shivam i have a request yeah. i have heard you yeah. right to admissions the like i said we want to help you but it is pretty hard for us and i'm very sure for every person sitting on first weekend of a month there are people who are saying all our weekends are working there are people who will say that second and fourth are working understand the reality of it and write to admissions at this stage i don't want to over promise and under deliver this will not be solvable write to admissions i am fine teaching fine people but all five of them are available at this stage can't make it second and fourth weekend of a month and okay. i <laughs> yeah No, go on. Uh, just wanted to know what will be the duration of those master classes, and will that be available for me to watch afterwards? Sure. Yeah. That's a good question. Hmm. Few of the fundamentals will be available. Few partially will be available because the cohort will operate on rolling basis. That means that if future in future someone comes and joins a program, he or she will be able to partially watch the coding master class. But would that do justice to your absenteeism? Hell no. I don't want to promote absenteeism to watch a recording because I know recordings don't work. I want to operate on live format. I want everyone here. That's the only way to learn. And next, you do a mark sheets. All right. Like okay, I said, right to admissions now. 
All right. Uh, those uh, classes will be of two hours or uh, what is the duration? Just if you can just let me know what it's will be. It's ten hours stuff. each. For oh, ten hours, uh, the whole day will be. Uh, uh, the classes will be there. I said ten hours on the weekend. How many do you think per day would be? Around five hours. Five. Approximately, yes. Okay. It could well, be here and there. You. Yeah. Thanks. Like I said, I don't want to over promise and under deliver. I want to under promise and over deliver. So if you're not available on the first and third weekend, I'm fine. Not ha- for and it's of course both of our loss. I understand. I think where you're coming from, Shubham, because you realize it's your loss. But it is what it is. I can't lie and then do still master classes on first and third weekend of a month. All right, Sushant. Hey, hi, Satakshi. First of all, thank you for the detailed uh, explanation on the cohort and. Uh, Uh, thank you for uh, allowing us to have this program for technology upskilling my question is uh, uh, i am very passionate to learn about new technologies but i also understand my limitation that since i have never been into coding or doing the hard stuff like uh, what is uh, the main aspect of technology how will it be, uh, be will it be something like simplified for somebody as a beginner or who can uh, get this later on practicing it will definitely help But in the initial stages, is there a jargonless uh, teaching going to happen for uh, uh, some somebody somebody who can consider themselves as a novice or beginner? Thank you. You just defined all IIT for me. Yeah. All IIT is going to be for beginners and for intermediate folks. All right, and I know that there are people with advanced uh, who are looking for advanced learning, and that's why there is an advanced section in your master class section. But that's going to be our job. But The most important thing, Sushant, is going to you going to make sure that you do pre-reads well. So, for example, for our first master class, which is management communication, after that your coding for CEOs will come. If you have never done coding in life, never done coding in your life, you make sure that you completely do the pre-readings. You watch all the videos that we decide. You practice the problem, and then you sit in the master class. It's almost like a Stanford culture. It's almost like the culture of the coaching class I was telling to you about in Delhi. But don't worry, we have got your back. That's what we have been talking to all the industry practitioners who are going to be coming and taking a master class. It's for beginners and intermediate folks, and for the advanced folks, there is an advanced section. But I want to re-emphasize: we have to make sure you all get the fundamentals right. Thank you. Cool. Good question. Anyone else? Arvin. Yeah, hi, Sadaki. So the first and third weekend again is a issue for me. I am working in a government bank, so we have first and third Saturdays working. So Sundays will be possible for me most of the times, but Saturday is an issue. So how can I address that? So I'm hearing you all. The best case scenario is hear me out. Is that you all learn entire ten hours on Sunday? All right. Which, by the way, is little tricky. Can Arvin tell me why? Arvin, too much to take in one day. Correct. So let Naman and I discuss. We don't want to build curriculum based on two or three people basis. While I really want to help you guys, we want to do things the way education should be imparted. All right. So let Naman and I discuss how we will be able to divide the weekend. and most importantly how the industry practitioners are available as well all right if a cto is coming from san francisco and he is not available on a saturday sorry on a sunday and then you come back and complain shataksh you said entire sunday na na i will always be like i said i will be very transparent right so i can try my best but do know that it's largely going to be weekend but naman and i can of course think and discuss about it but we know largely what has been the model that has been successful till now going on that we will get all saturdays uh, off uh, for the government banks but I'm, i have not i was not asking you purposefully which bank <laughs> is this why are you guys working on weekend that's why it's for professionals all, so all, all government banks work on first and third saturdays presently <laughs> sure oh i have pity i really hope that you get to learn so let us find a solution our objective is to create an inclusive system at the same time not at not cost deteriorate the quality of the ecosystem right right, right, right. I, i whatever works uh, like best Correct. possible i am i uh, because uh, the objective is to learn and you know be, become better at some technology aspects 
because uh, otherwise it's uh, really difficult uh, to see uh, anything in future uh, if we are ill retreats in technology so no that's not the case but at the same time i genuinely believe people need weekends to themselves that's the only way they'll be able to grow for themselves i mean if you're working throughout 7 yeah. days we'll move on there is poon poonema waiting i am sure she has diverse queries but uh, i have heard you all our objective is to create inclusive ecosystem while consciously creating what we are creating for purnima over to you sorry um so thank you for the opportunity here i did hear the entire course curriculum really excited for it uh one uh, right now i'm a product owner and i'm looking at this course structure as uh, to groom myself with more of ai knowledge as well as see how it will embrace uh, this new you know this part of a section where you can explore both being a product owner and understand the system better for the future and all that so um looking forward to it but then what i'm curious on what is going to be covered as part of system designing because that is most crucial for a product owner as well so um so that's my first question and then the second question is um i don't know when you are men- when you were mentioning about um you know if someone from bay area chooses a master to teach a master class over one of the times would it would the timings be according to est or uh, according to sorry pst or ist or whatever because it has to work either ways right so how would the timings be managed no i am going to be making all of you wake up at 3 am and that is how we are going to be delivering this content I hope we understand the sarcasm. <laughs> I know it is sarcasm but I don't mind it because I am also uh, in the United States and you know it will be like a different time zone shift for me which is perfectly okay considering the situation I am in right now. Uh I don't mind uh, you know staying late nights and stuff to um uh, hear the classes uh, that happen according to IST time zone but just was curious. <laughs> I really hope you are able to make friends after seeing whatever you did because people I'm not <laughs> sure are going to be keen to attend at 3 am but uh, <laughs> it's going to be our headache punnima don't worry about it i'm aware that uh, there are students in IST in US time zones as well in fact i'm not sure if you are based out of india there are people based out of us also at this point of time who are going to be attending this so we interestingly have a strategic advantage in all tiet that strategic advantage at all tiet is we have immense data point of gj to understand what works what doesn't work what makes someone get a job of his or her dream and what doesn't what are the typical pitfalls why people fail so keep operations aside we are going to be handling that really well for all of you on the first question system design very good question currently we are at a level of things that you would have seen on the screen such as url shortener and case studies as well aditya for now is working directly with me on creating the curriculum after talking to more than 30 people the speaker for your system design master class has been figured out as well i would appreciate patience till the time your system design master class happens because that is where a lot of detail will follow for all of you um, like i said your success is my success and we are keeping all of that on ourselves Shikhar, what's your question? So yeah, I uh, I wanted to ask from a perspective uh, of, of of my side. Uh, I, since I have like uh, good enough experience of uh, coding per se for last ten years, I I'm working in this field. So wanted to ask like uh, if we if uh, I can skip uh, classes like my Python basics, like data structures algorithms, and can skip to like uh, and uh, go to sessions like system design directly. Uh, or or like uh, pick and choose which which master classes suits my uh, uh, my uh, like uh, requirement for 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 this uh, you know upskilling good question shikhar i know your profile i saw it as well there is one more person who is sitting with 10 years of uh, experience in tech uh, like you do you know there was uh, a finance wizard uh, studying with me at isb yet he sat in all of the classes can you take a guess why literally a finance wizard to rehash uh, all of the basics and and, uh, and you know yeah i like rehash and uh, maybe like get on to uh, upskilling maybe in that field but i saw uh, i saw in the curriculum anyways 
Uh, according to me, it's just rehashing the knowledge here. Yeah. I think my answer was in the question, Shikhar. I called him a finance wizard. I remember him as a finance wizard. He made plenty of friendship on ISB campus. He's working in Bain right now. After sitting okay. in the finance class, I would have never okay. gotten to know him if he would have never sat in the class. If he would have taken deferrals from that class. So I leave the ball in your court. You could become okay. the star of all IIT if you are sitting in Python class. You could help your peers crack a lot of interviews by sitting in other classes as well if you choose so. But I go back to the basics that we was thinking. What can we give and not just get? But I leave the ball in your court. I understand where you're coming from. But what I've realized is many a times how people remember you may come from a point of strength, may not just scope of improvement, and you never know. If you are the one who starts helping people around, and when your time comes, you get almost fifty-one hands raised up in all IIT that we are going to help Shikhar now. So that's my answer. You can find your answer. All right? Sure. Thank you. Perfect. Mohit, I see your hand is up as well. Uh, so Sakshi, I am also from a coding background, and my question is, I, I think uh, I already had the answer in the. But my question about the body system or the class, how the class will be balanced with a non-coding background and coding background? Because I am assuming that a few of them having a good amount of experience in coding. So, how are you going to manage the class? I understand, Mohit. Why are you asking that question? And uh, I know it's a repeat question. I'll still attempt it, and I also attempt it, knowing why you're asking, whatever you're asking. Let me give a statistics because I have it, and you might not have it. People with zero coding experience should know that you are not a minority in all IIT. You are a majority at all IIT. Okay, that means that you are not your headache. You are upon me. I am trying to solve for it. All right, but my answer will remain the same. You can help yourself. I will help. Industry practitioners will help. They will get the context. They will have the context. Non coders are sitting in the class. The pre-reads, the person who is designing the pre-reads will be given the context. There are non-coders sitting in the class. There are people with intermediate experience are sitting in the class. People with advanced experience are sitting in the class. All right. So my answer doesn't change, and you have to be patient till that time. Your first coding for CEO master class will be converted. If I will unfold everything, what will you do on third weekend of June? It's a six-month journey. You have to cover that six-month journey. All right. And by the way, we are feedback obsessed, and I think it's my consulting culture that made me feedback obsessed. After every master class, after every session, we take feedback. I also know the power of good feedback and nonsense feedback, so we are smart enough to clutter, declutter that out. But we will always look forward to understanding what's happening and what's not happening. All right. So even it's a repeat question. I understand the fear that you have, Mohit. We are coming from that place, and that's how all the instructors will be guided. But you have to make sure, and you have to promise not me, but yourself, that you will sit with all the pre-reads in the master class. All right. I hope that helps. In the interest of time, this was a one-hour scheduled call for all of you. I'll take one more question, and then, of course, like I said, a detailed next step welcome email will come to all of you with the attachments, and then your first master class will happen on. First weekend of June and third weekend of June, like we said, on the two requests that have come to us, we will hear them out and let Naman and I brainstorm how is there a way out, not compromising the ecosystem, because that is something we will never do. Sri Harshini, you go next. Uh, hi, like, can you can provide you? information on job support, please? Sure. Can I get to see you? Yes. Information for information. Perfect. Thank you so much. It's always good to talk to people. So we have OCS at GGI, Office of Career Services, all right, uh, which is student-led community. Anyone of you is aware about placement cell in institutes? Anyone? Obviously. Raise your Zoom hands. Okay, you know that. Uh, anyone wants to answer? Actually, Sri Harshini, can you answer that for me? What are what do placement cell do, and who are those people who drive placement cells? uh they will take some sort of interviews and they will guide you what all you need to do and then the uh, actual interviews will be done to you sure that's almost wrong answer sorry um i'll have someone else it's okay 
it's a safe ecosystem give as many wrong answers as possible is the safe ecosystem of all it anyone else who understand who comprises these placement cell who are these people deorishi they are the people of the automated cell who help them in managing and getting uh, tech or of the student on board help them get it that's the right answer the ocs of gji in the initial phase is going to help all iit as well but my understanding is all iit should have and needs to have its own ocs and in fact in some week of june we are going to be announcing ocs of all iit also all right so the short answer to you sri harshini is we have more than 75 plus employment partners from global governance initiative who which are the firms that hire for policy and consulting and other roles for gji which is gji the same firms hire for ai system design and tech pm also they have those roles they will hire for all iit only once you will complete your level 1 and so on and so forth but my running answer is there should be a separate answer of ocs for all iit also all right don't get confused delete that part if you heard that because that's in my future plans i'm sharing all of that but at some point of time we'll announce ocs for all iit also all right running answer but it's the first answer that should suffice for you all shivam i'll take one more question yeah hi stuffy so i wanted to ask one question like the the eight master class we will have so uh, there are many many roles uh, are there in that so like uh, uh, how to get uh, like into your domain like if you are not uh, getting it right uh, what will be best fit for you i didn't get the question i am sorry i'm going to request you to repeat it there are nine master classes right. by the way not eight but go on yeah so there are many master classes so uh, many roles are associated with that for for job perspective so like how to get it uh, for right a uh, job perspective for you like which suits best for you okay if i understood the question right you're asking which master class for which role first and foremost all it stands for artificial intelligence tech pm and system design we are not solving for everything because i know when you start solving for 100 roles you solve for nothing so we are just solving for three things second part is shivam all the master classes are mandatory for you not optional and we have consciously decided why because people's mind changed there are so many people for example in gj who wanted to become a consultant but after a pm master class they absolutely fell in love with product management and they wanted to become a product manager we don't want to debar you from learning and from exploration somebody in the starting talked about curiosity right so we will do that part there are three roles we are talking about there are exactly three master classes in the advanced section about that and then there are fundamentals and then there is soft skill all right so you have to attend all you are not choosing cool it's in your benefit you are getting more than what you have frankly paid for so take it and expand your thought horizons all right i see more questions okay we'll extend it for 10 more minutes in the interest of all of your question um to be fair i'll take sai your question then jinal and if time permits i'll come back to sri sai over to you um in it industry uh, we would say work work experience matter during recruitment you asking or are you telling i'm i'm asking you actually in it industry work, work experience matter during recruitment in all day day also same like that or anything else so i somehow feel that it's not a question it's a comment that's the way it's been coming to me but uh, first and foremost we don't want to have a mam and sal culture call me shatakshi it's a lateral okay. ecosystem oh, okay. that's how okay. we want to it to be it depends for which role where are you coming from what are the skills for every one person you will show me with 5 years of work experience in tech product management i'll show you 10 more people with zero work experience in tech product management similarly and it's the study that we have also done similarly with system design and there are people with zero work experience also getting into artificial intelligence and that is something that i really like about the world of tech more than business and strategy roles they are much more fixated a little more than tech about pedigree about how many years of work experience relatively 
right in business and in strategy roles they are much more anal about mba etc etc we are trying to change that narrative massively and we have done that in gji as well the relative understanding is that here they care more about skill my first hire at gji as a startup was someone who was 12th pass out did not even get into college brilliant coder eventually he went on to iit delhi and then of course we departed ways but what i am trying to say startups msmes and many organizations are able to bet on you if you are willing to bet upon yourself which is the initial point we said asymmetric bets janal hi satakshi so considering like you mentioned that we'll be having sessions on weekends right so there happens to be quarter endings wherein i have really hectic days and we happen to work throughout the weekends as well for you know a month or a coming considering the meetings and everything so will it be possible to have recordings for the classes that we've missed out or considering that a busy month coming ahead it's a good question i really wish you well when your quarter ending comes <laughs> Second, uh, you will learn about this when product management masterclass comes. Okay. Never ever reach out to a customer for solution. Reach out to a customer for problem. So, Jinnar, your problem statement is that you are not going to be available for a few weekends. What should be the solution? The solution is a deferral. It's not recording. And trust me, I am doing a lot of you a lot of benefit by not putting you through the recording. If recording was the answer, Coursera is the right answer. If recording were the answer, why are you sitting here all? Yeah. Right. Deferral is the answer. What will happen is, and in fact, this will all come was about to come in the Monday email, which is that if there is a master class, let's say your first master class is on first weekend of June, which is third of June. If you write to us by thirty first of May that I am not going to be available, you will get a free deferral. We will accommodate you, Jinal, the next time it happens, which is after four months, four to five months, five months, in fact. all right so you will get deferral i don't suggest deferral i am not an advocate of deferral because if you will keep on deferral you will not learn anything in your 6 months we have to also deliver this in 6 months right so deferral is the answer but not any last moment deferral which is the important point if we will receive emails on saturday night i can't do this on sunday then i i'll be very candid as an entrepreneur we have taken the cost of the master class i burned that cost of the master class right i am rejecting someone to have you in the master class not you jinal but yeah, 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 if yeah. someone in that case is just being sheer lazy and says that i can't show up on a saturday for a sunday master class or on a friday for a saturday master class then you will not get a deferral why because you are debarring someone to enter that master class because we allowed you were cancelling someone else and you are being lazy I know life happens many a times. Medical emergencies happen that we all understand and respect. We are all mature professionals. But I think if we take priority to all tiety, we will be able to have clarity by Wednesday of that weekend if we need a deferral or not. But like I said, I am not a huge advocate of deferral. So avoid it at all cost because there is a rhythm. You miss one master class, you meet us after a month at least. Yeah. Correct. So there is a rhythm. Don't miss it in your own benefit. But I understand if you have work going on, bare minimum professionalism. Let us know by Wednesday of that week. But we have got you covered. These are real scenarios. We understand that. But not recordings. Recordings will be there just from bare minimum revision point of view, and there will be just three master classes for which recordings will be there, and that too partially. We will not be operating on recorded lectures. We will be operating on live master classes. You all take out time. You all show up. you have your cameras on i know that there are few people who are not able to have cameras on this time it's fine this time next time it's not be all operated i myself as much as motivated i am if i go to a bcg alumni meeting and there are discussions happening and if i have my camera off i don't remember half of what they said there is clear data point and correlation people who understand statistics people who will have cameras on will succeed at all tiety i can give this to you in writing we have strong data points to check that there is direct correlation so if you will have cameras off and you will come back and say that i didn't understand python it's your problem make sure you we are all living in the world of geo get your data recharges done pretty affordable right but make sure that you are ready 
you are in your professional self you are not slouching on the couch you show up in your professional attire it's a professional ecosystem i'm deviating a little bit than what jinal said but i'm also using that question as an opportunity to talk about the etiquette at all tiet it's not an undergrad ecosystem whereby you just come and sit on a couch and think that you'll get the magic done no get your camera on good wear casuals or smart casuals look into the camera and interact with the speaker or solve the problem with your buddies that's how things will get done in all tiet nishant sorry <laughs> hello sashi i'm really excited and lucky to get able to enroll in this course and uh, my four questions are already like good soul but uh, one question is like will be able to get the ppt or notes which uh, which the tutor is going to be shared in their sessions it's a very good question so the, the hardest class at isp is dmop it's <laughs> a state before statistics the moment i realize i am going to get notes i didn't pay heed to my speaker so i'm not going to release that answer just show up in the class i worry if i will give you so much material or so much answers beforehand you always think okay for the lack of better word in hindi material mil jayega kuch aur mil jayega recording mil jayega why to make the effort but i know that people are just procrastinators so i'm not going to answer that consciously <laughs> because i fear it will meddle with your learning all right but good okay, question right. at some point of time we'll get all the answers by the way in the journey <laughs> just need a little yeah. trust in the system okay okay right <laughs> sure. thank you so much i'll move to sri harshini first because she's been raising her hand for a while now and then aprajita go on sri yes yeah. like i wanted to know what specific roles you will be giving the like a job assistant sir what do you think will be the answer to this question for me it would be more of a data analyst or a product management side the top banner of all it says artificial intelligence system design and product management so data analyst machine learning artificial intelligence one bucket tech product management and system design system design if we find a very good quality software engineering roles also then we might circulate it but that's okay. the arena we are operating in uh, is there like a assistant for data science also data scientist it depends if tech mahindra is hiring for data scientist then yes they will hire from alt it but i can't create a role for data scientist for them but like i said it's the ai tech product management system design we will not be able to entertain a lot of individual requests because we all transparently signed up for this but to my mind data science data analyst ai ml almost like one bucket all right and it depends what is the employer hiring at that point of time whatever roles they open at that point of time will come back and hire from you all i hope that helps aprajita over to you yeah hi sakshi uh so i am um, i have a business and strategy background and i plan to continue to stay in that domain but my objective for signing up to this uh, was really to kind of uh, you know come up to speed with the changing technology landscape uh so is that a fair expectation to have from this program i'm if i'm not specifically looking to become uh, an artificial intelligence engineer or a systems engineer i think to my mind it's the most fantastic application of the program and also tell you why aprajita you and i are sitting in the same position my mind has been poof, blown away ever since i've been exposed to alt it and alt it was an idea that actually came to namanin me almost last year and ever since we have been researching talking to gazillion people gazillion universities in the west coast and east coast uh i always say it's almost like hogwarts help will always be given to those at hogwarts who ask or who need for it so i think the answer is hell yes it's almost like what indra nui says that the biggest challenge that she faced in the initial years of pepsico was actually around technology and she had to really upskill herself and i'm actually proud that people and leaders like you real are self realizing that we need this and are investing in themselves because the reality is so uh, this is just catching up at a very fast pace so hell yes and of course uh, happy to help you personally in the journey in any way i can thank you very much pleasure i think we have largely covered 
largely covered most of the questions it's been an honor it's been a privilege to meet you all and like i said i once took an asymmetrical bet upon myself in life you should give a pat on your back to take that asymmetrical bet upon yourself too life is much more than just video recorded lectures so i really hope that you come out of that zone as well it's a mindset shift right see people look at people on sundays and weekends you should look forward to doing that i'm so used to hearing that weekends were the most productive part of my learning and i really wish you best i'm going to be seeing you personally on the first weekend of june which is going to be your management communication master class we are starting with soft skills first so that we start with the bank and then slowly and steadily we will i don't want to overwhelm you right slowly and steadily we will build things up you will find a lot of answers during the journey but most importantly i can actually vouch for this you will find your best friends in this community because you all are in this together that's it from my side naman do you have any last comments before we wrap up all right nothing specific i think uh, allow me to demotivate you for a few minutes i think uh, almost all of you are very anxious about what's going to be in store all of you should be anxious because it's a new ecosystem for you and all of you should be in uncomfortable situation because in those situations you will learn so my only request is make as many mistakes as possible in this ecosystem do not worry do not care what the other person is thinking about you they are all here to learn they are all here to grow and i can assure you in time to come they will all come to your assistance so please do not be bogged down by the fact what the other party might think about me that is not at all how you will grow you will ensure that you are actively participating in all classes and please make mistakes please make all the mistakes with us here in the community don't make mistakes when you're in the real world but here make as many mistakes as possible because that is how you will learn brilliant words thank you so much naman for those words of deep motivation with that we are going to be wrapping up your onboarding session for all tiet i look forward to seeing all of you on first june and many more weekends ahead it's not going to be a journey of 6 months it's going to be a journey of a lifetime thank you so much for all your trust see you soon ciao